Hello there. Together, we will set up a coming soon and a maintenance page in Quickly. The coming soon page is useful when your website has not yet been launched, after you have registered your domain name, but before you have finished designing your website. This gives you time to create interest in your upcoming site before you launch it, and it allows Google to start sending you visitors. The maintenance page is used when your website is temporarily offline for a short period of time to allow you to make changes or updates. The search engines are informed that your site is down, but your site's SEO will not be affected by the downtime. Remember that it is very important to use each type correctly, because if you choose the wrong option, you can harm your site's SEO rankings. Here we are in the Quickly Thema. As you can see, we have set up a front page template, a coming soon template, and a maintenance template. As things stand, when a user visits the site, they will land on the front page. Before we set up the conditions for when the desired template is shown, either front page, off, coming soon or maintenance, we can set up an ACF custom field so that we can easily control which template to display when the user visits the site. This will be by means of a button group that we will set up together so that the user can switch from one template to another to save time. But first, we need to create an options page for our button group. So download your favorite snippet plugin to add the code necessary to activate the ACF options page, which is not activated by default. Add a new snippet and name it ACF options page or as required. Paste in the code available in the video description. Activate it. You should now see an options tab appear in the dashboard. The options page is empty by default. Let's add a new field group for our different template choices. Open the Custom Fields tab in the dashboard and add a new field. Name your field group. In the Fields tab, select Button Group as field type. Give your field label a name. We want to set three choices, Coming Soon, Maintenance and Off, when we want to see the current template. So input the value and label, separated by a colon for each choice. Now, to make your button group globally available, we need to attach it to the options page we set up before. To do this, in Settings, select Options page in the drop-down. Save your changes. Let's open the options page where you will find the button group. Let's set it to Off. In order for us to be able to see the different options, we need to set up the conditions under which each different template will appear. Open the Quickly Thema. Open the visibility conditions for the Coming Soon template. Click the plus icon to set the conditions. We want our Coming Soon template to appear if the Coming Soon button is selected in the Options page. To do this, set Show Don't Show to Show If. Set Type to ACF. Set Group to Coming Soon and Maintenance. Set field to coming soon slash maintenance. Set current to options as you want to retrieve the data from the options page and not from the current post. Set operator to equals. Set value to coming soon. You need to enable override page template because by default, if you set a specific template on a specific page through the editor, this template will override anything else you set up unless you enable the override page template. Set priority to 99 to ensure it will override other templates. Let's go to the front end, which still shows the front page. In order to show the coming soon template, you need to select the appropriate choice in the options page. So let's go to the options page and select the coming soon button. Update and check it out on the front end. Now, let's turn our attention to the maintenance template. Return to the thema and open the visibility conditions. Click the plus icon. Set show, don't show to show if. Set type to ACF. Set group to coming soon and maintenance. 
Set field to coming soon slash maintenance. Set current to options. Set operator to equals. Set value to maintenance. Enable override page template. Set priority to 99 to ensure it will always be on the top of all the other pages. For the maintenance template, we need to enter a status code of 503 so that, as we said before, the search engines are informed that your site is down but your site's SEO will not be affected by the downtime. The coming soon template is currently visible on the front end, so let's go to the options and select maintenance. Update and check it out on the front end. If we open our network panel, you can see that our 503 status is being returned. You may want to be able to visualize what you are working on as the admin, or to show a client while keeping the coming soon or maintenance template visible for other users. To do this, in the visibility conditions, click the plus icon to add another condition. Set do not show if, set type to user role, set operator to equals, and select the role, usually admin, that you wish to target. This will hide the maintenance or coming soon template for the targeted user role. Let's check it out on the front end. As admin, you will now be able to visualize your front page while other users see the maintenance or coming soon template. And that's how to set up a coming soon and maintenance template.